Hey guys, how are you doing? It's Gavin here from the, the Growing Younger team. And uh, today's video is um, something that I find that a lot of my clients and a lot of people over the age of 45 really struggle to, uh, to do, okay? It's called the hip hinge. Um, and here at Growing Younger, we don't always teach the best exercise. We teach movement patterns. And a hip hinge is a movement pattern that uh, as we get older, we kind of forget how to use, okay? Because we get lazy, we get sedentary, um, and we just forget how to do it. And this, this one um, movement, if you like, literally causes so much problems, so, many, so much back pain issues, uh, tight hamstrings, you name it, it causes uh, a ton of problems. Now, the, uh, what people don't realize is that we uh, have a massive hinge in our body. It's called our hips, all right? If I stand up here, this, this is a big hinge. It allows me to bend, bend further forward. But what happens is we get super lazy, okay? Because we lose a bit of strength, lose a bit of mobility, we tend to do all the bending from our lower back. It causes a massive problem. Uh, it loads up, um, loads up your spine unnecessarily. Your muscles get weak. Your muscles um, stop, sort of, or they turn off a little bit. They don't work as they should. And it causes so many problems. So this one movement I'm gonna give you is probably gonna be one of the best things that you can practice as you get older, certainly if you're not very active. Um, it's very, very simple, it looks simple, but people really, really struggle. And if you don't believe me, give it a go yourself. I guarantee you're gonna make some of these, um, these little mistakes that I'm gonna tell you. So um, give me one second and I will uh, demonstrate it for you. And if you can practice this on a daily basis, you will find your whole movement, your whole body movement will get better. So when we, uh, when we sit down on a chair or something, you can see that my body has a nice sort of bend in the middle, it's a hinge on my hips, okay? And if I stand up nice and tall, if I straighten my leg to keep the hinge, what will happen is I will bend over. Okay, you can see I've got a nice flat back, right? So this movement here is the position of, of, of strength. My lower back is engaged. My glutes are sort of stretched out. I've got some tension on my hamstrings. And this hinging movement allows me to stay nice and strong. But what we do, people forget that this is a hinge. And when we want to pick something up, we bend from the lower back. You can see my back is all sort of rounded now. And that causes so many problems. So what I want you to do is literally practice this exercise. Call it kind of a, I don't know, hip hinge or butt back or whatever you want to call it. But I want you to keep your chest up nice and tall. Okay? I want you to think of a, a, a piece of string pulling you forward. And I want to think of a piece of string pulling your bum back. And as this stays up, this comes back. And now I come into this position, my back is nice and flat, okay? Put my hands on my hips just a little bit and bring it forward and take a hip hinge back this way. Nearly everybody I come across really struggles with this and they kind of, they bend forward and they, they, can't, they can't move it, the hips get stuck. Um, and it's something that you need to address for you to move better. So what we're gonna do, stand up, give us a try, see how you go. Chest up nice and tall. Take, take, uh, use your, your hands and your, as a bit of a cue if you like, and take your hips forward. When your hips come back, you're gonna feel a big stretch on the back of the hamstrings, and that's actually a good thing. That means you're loading up your hamstrings so they can do a lot of the work. Um, and it's gonna save you when you're bending down to pick things up. It's gonna save your back, it's gonna save you hurting yourself. Um, and like I said, this is one of the key movements in, uh, in, in body movements. Everything you do, everything you lift, everything you carry, comes from the hip hinge, right? So hopefully I've explained that exercise really well. Um, if you are struggling with back pain or strength um, and you, you're looking for um, you know, an, um, a new program and you live in Howick, then the best way that we can help you is through the Growing Younger program, okay? We teach you these, these basic functional exercises so you can move better, you can live better, you can enjoy growing older while being active and, and you can work out in a safe environment, okay? And obviously you can work out in our cool little studio which has only been open about three weeks. Um, it's nice and quiet for now, all right? So any problems at all, guys, there's a link down below, okay? If you, wanna, if, if you need some help, um, by all means, jump in, fill out the expression of interest form. We'll get back to you in about two or three days and we'll see if the Growing Younger program is right for you. Hope you enjoyed the video. Give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment if you did. And I will hopefully see you soon. Take care, guys. Bye.